it's me Vishal from the Code City again and uh, after a lot of requests I'll be finally showing you how we can install PIP in Windows so let's just get started this is going to be a quick win so first open your command prompt and check if you have Python I assume you'll already have Python but I'm going to check it anyway so if you type Python you'll get this or uh, if you want to check your version you can just go Python dash V as you can see I have this Python 3.6 installed. Alright, now back to installing PIP. So, first you need to download a file called getpip.py. So, just type getpip in your search bar and then download it from here. Okay, now after it's downloaded, just I'm just going to move it to the desktop and let's just go to desktop or wherever I just moved it to desktop but you can go to whichever directory you have your getpip.py installed now from here I'm going to type get.py python getpip.py and just run this and now it will install your PIP since I already have it installed it's just going to show already installed or whatever now to check if it's properly installed you can just go PIP and dash V so you can get your PIP version from here it's pretty low 10.0.1 I need to upgrade it <laughs> I will and maybe that time I'll show you how you can upgrade it too and if you want to know more PIP commands you can just type PIP and help and you'll get a whole bunch of commands that you can use with your pip alright so this is it for this time it's a very quick one if you have any problems you shouldn't have any problems but if you have any problems feel free to drop them below I'll answer them to the best of my capabilities so thank you till next time peace out